Benedictine University is a small liberal arts university. We are in the suburbs of Chicago. We have a small school field with one-on-one -on -one interaction between students and faculty, but at the same time we have a very good curriculum, uh, so it gives the students a broad feel of what mathematics is all about. You will see a lot of diversity on our campus. We have a variety of courses. For the beginning students, we have options like instead of calculus, they can do uh, integrated calculus in which they could do the same material over two semesters. We have pre-calculus concepts in such a way that students get the refresher they need at precisely the time they need it. This not only helps them be successful in, in the calculus class, but it prepares them for higher level mathematics as well. And I think it illustrates how we do business around here. The curriculum at Benedictine is very unique in the sense that we offer uh, classes that are really outside of the traditional math curriculum. We offer courses in a lot of special areas like mathematical biology and cryptology, as well as undergraduate research experiences for every math major. The computational science and mathematics support each other. Our students take math courses as part of their requirements. Students in mathematics are required to take at least one of our computer science classes. The other departments in the College of Science, including chemistry, physics, and the biological sciences, all have mathematics required, and most also have a computer requirement. So we're trying to support both of those needs. There is a definite shift towards uh, biomath. Actually, we have a lot of students who come in wanting to major in health sciences. I want to do an um, MD-PhD program, and I chose math because in modern day uh, biology, we have a lot of um, math application. We really want to encourage undergraduate research and the COS has a program of summer research for undergraduates. The students get financial support and therefore they can be here the entire summer to work with faculty on undergraduate research projects. Many of our students in mathematics are working in research areas outside of just the pure math area, doing biomathematics research, doing computer science research, or doing pure mathematics research if that happens to be their particular interest. I gained more confidence being able to present as undergrad research student and also I learned more of um, different variety of mathematics and application with biology too. I think we offer our students the opportunity to do research in every course. Even in my Calculus 1 course they're doing research but we expose them to research at every level and I think that that type of exposure helps our students be prepared for what happens in the real world. I think it's important especially for our students to see that math is not just a set of equations to solve, a set of functions to work with. It's something that gets applied in all these different areas. You're going to walk away from us having an appreciation and a knowledge of what math can do in other areas. It's a bit of a cliche to say that we're very student-centered but it really is the case because we have small enough class sizes that you really do get to know your students. You work with them on a regular basis. We try to create facilities that actually support that. So we have a dedicated laboratory that our computer science students use. We actually have a table that math students sit around and solve problems together. And the faculty are on the scene. They're prepared to provide help over and above just the regular office hours. I've been involved in Student Senate, which represents the students on campus. My experience as a president of Student Senate has been a wonderful experience. Uh, it's been amazing getting to see how the administration really takes concerns from the students and listens to them trying to impact the campus. I meet with the president, vice president, and provost once per month, and they're always very willing to meet with me to hear the student concerns. I think the, the relationship that takes place between professor and student is something that is valued and is very unique to Benedictine. Professors take a personal interest in the lives of the students and seeing what they were when they come in the door and then seeing what they are when they go out the door and knowing that we had a part to play in that transformation that took place, that really is very deeply satisfying. <laughs>